there's a lot of talk about the solar eclipse and lots of claims about what it could do to your cell phone. We went to the experts to answer the most common questions and bust the most common myths. Let's verify. With thousands of people expected to travel into the path of totality of the solar eclipse, people are wondering how their cell phones might be affected. One of the most common questions, does a solar eclipse make your cell phone act strangely? Our sources are four major cell service carriers, Verizon, AT&T, US Cellular, and T-Mobile, and two major phone manufacturers, Apple and Google. They all say no. T-Mobile says solar eclipses do not increase the amount of electromagnetic radiation, so your technology should work as normal. U.S. Cellular agrees. No, that is not something that we have seen the solar eclipse affect our, our wireless devices. However, if you're planning on taking pictures of the eclipse, experts say it's good to have a filter to put over your camera to protect it. In addition to making sure that only the most important light filters through, you actually have a really good shot of spotting some sunspots along the way if you use it properly. That filter does not double as eclipse glasses. So we can verify it's false. The eclipse will not make your cell phone act strangely, but you should protect the camera if you're taking pictures. 